<laughs> flabbergasted, insanely surprised. I'm just. How is this real? How is this fucking real? I, I could never predict this. I could. I just. I, I'm so excited. I'm so excited to see the downfall of Mr. Beast. I'm so. I'm so. I'm so excited. Hello. Hello. Welcome to the stream. How we doing? Today? Oh fuck! I always forget to get water. That's what I always forget to fucking do. Heaven. Should be doobie, don't you know each cloud contains pennies from heaven? Should be doobie, you'll find your fortune fall at first. You are not first cool guy. Dude man has been here for 40 minutes. And just sitting in my offline chat and also pointing out the grind. Thank you for the grind point. Yeah, I appreciate it. What's up, Yessie Twitch? Welcome to the stream chat. Guys, I'm actually fucking... I'm so shocked that this is real. I am so... So shocked that this is real today. Oh my fucking god. This is I'm so, I'm I'm crying. I'm so happy. I am crying. I am so happy. This is so funny. Don't tell my parents I'm here. Okay, fine. Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. I won't I won't tell them. I won't I won't tell your parents because I definitely have contact with your parents for some reason. I don't I, I don't have contact with your parents, but but sure, I won't tell them. Guys, I am I I'm, uh, I'm crying. I'm crying. I can't believe this is real. I can't believe this is real. Welcome to the stream. How are you guys doing today? How's everybody feeling? What's up, Yessie? What's up, Clove? Cool guy. Ghostly. Hi, Ghostly. Just starting the video already. I want to see it again. No, dude. Guys, you don't understand. You don't understand how crazy this is. Also, guys, look at my cool sweater. Cool sweater. Ravenclaw. Ravenclaw. Yes. Yes. Awesome. Isn't it cool? I've got a Harry Potter sweater. I've got a Harry Potter. Look at it. Look at it. I got a Harry Potter sweat. If you beat Night 6, I'll give you 95 bit. Okay, well, I'm not playing FNAF today. Thank you so much for coming if you wanted to see FNAF. Guys, we're seeing something better than FNAF today. I never thought that this day would be coming. Hi, Ashiki. Is it okay if I call you Ash? I feel like it'd be better. Yeah, yeah, most people call me Ash. Two A's, though. Make sure you put the two A's. The two A's is important. You call me Ash with one A? I'm not, run I'm not fucking responding to your goddamn message. All right? I wanted FNAF. FNAF will be back. FNAF will be back. Don't you worry. Guys, we this is crazy. This is insane that this is real, guys. It, it, Mr. Beast has pulled a Charlie D'Amelio fucking classist move. I'm just... I'm so utterly shocked and in, in disbelief. We need to see this together, chat, because you must experience this with me. I could have never expected this to happen. I'm so shocked. If you haven't seen Mr. Beast's new video yet, oh my god, chat, just the title will, is insane. He just displayed different jobs. No, 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 guys, guys, this is crazy. This is insane. Ravenclaw? Yeah, Ravenclaw. Chat, what's your Harry Potter house? What's your Harry Potter house? I'm a Ravenclaw. I'm a Ravenclaw. You know, I'm blue. I'm Ravenclaw. I, guys, blue just surrounds me in my life. I'm just such a blue person, even though my favorite color is maroon. <laughs> uh, hello, everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Yo, what's up, Athena? Yo, Arctic Fox Gaming Panda. Hello, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? Uh, what's up, Russian spy? I'm also Ravenclaw. Yeah, Hufflepuff. That's rough. Ravenclaw. Yeah, Ravenclaw. Yeah. Got a lot of Ravenclaws in chat. That's base. That's base, chat. You're based. What can I say? What can I say? You're based and real. Everything but Hufflepuff is base. You know what I mean? No, Hufflepuff's fine. Hufflepuff's fine. I, I'm pretty sure I'm Ravenclaw or Gryffindor. Yeah, I'm kind of on that spectrum. I, I, I've done like, I've done like a hundred tests for my Harry Potter house. And it's been like, it's like, it's like, it's like, uh, it's like 70, 30. Or no, like 60, 40. Like 60 Ravenclaw and then 40. Sometimes I get, sometimes I get Gryffindor. But like nothing other than that. I get like, I get either Ravenclaw or Gryffindor depending on what fucking test I take. But I, I, I did a hundred just to like verify, you know what I mean? I can't just take one test, come on. Is it the one where he gets buried or no? No, 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 it's a new video. It's not the buried one. It's even crazier. This is the, guys, I will say it right now. This is the craziest Mr. Beast title fucking ever. And I, and I really hope the video holds up to the standards of the title of this video. Because this is insane. I have never seen a Mr. Beast title that has shocked me so fucking internally before. I was so just shocked. Also, my stream was good. I'm so glad you had a good stream. Guys, this sweater is slightly itchy, I'm not gonna lie, but I wear it, you know, I, I persevere through the pain, um, because, 
I mean, it's awesome. It's a fucking Harry Potter sweater. This was like, uh, I got this at Universal. It was awesome. That's a bad word. What's a bad word? What did I say? What did I say? No, no, no. I would never swear. I would never say a bad. I would never swear or say bad things. I'm just. I'm a kind boy. I'm a kind, nice boy, and I would never do anything bad. All right. Let me send out a Discord note of sent. Sent. Yeah. I just want to get into this fucking video, man. I, I'm just waiting like a minute. I. I, I want to get into this video because this is crazy and insane. And I. Oh my God. You think I got the sub thinking you would never swear? Wait, what? I swear all the time. I swear all this all the time. What do you mean? I'm so confused. Ash, we should have a family friendly stream. Fuck no. Why would I do a stream when I don't swear? When I can say fuck shit and piss all the time. All right. I, I it's not like I'm gonna get like insane amounts of viewers if I fucking if I do a family friendly stream. Every suddenly I'm uh, suddenly I'm gonna have a thousand viewers if I do family friendly. No, no. Maybe I'll get one extra person being like ah. Oh, Finally, he's he's going against his morals and he's doing what's right for society. No, fuck shit, piss cum. That's what I say. Put me on speaker for your parents to hear. Chat. When I was a kid, you know, honestly, I feel bad if I'm on speaker for you guys and you don't have headphones. Cause when I was a kid, I watched like Sky Does Minecraft and a bunch of swearing YouTubers, and literally YouTube got banned in my house when I was a kid because I watched too many swearing YouTubers and I got pissed off so badly at them because they would just swear so much. So, I uh, hope I don't do that to you. But you guys should be- Don't say your ages in chat, but you should be above the age of 13. Which means you should be fucking swearing by now, goddammit. I was swearing by the age of 13. I was- I was swearing earlier than that. But I was, like, allowed to swear. I was allowed to swear when I was, like, 15, 6. When I was, like, 15. My parents didn't really care about me swearing anymore. Earlier than that, they definitely- They didn't care. But when I got, like, 15, they were like, eh, ah, who gives a shit anymore, man. Uh, I was swearing by like 11 Well, so you know what happened actually it's a funny story at my mom's house so my parents are divorced right at my mom's house uh, We noticed that everyone in the house was swearing so like I was swearing my brother was swearing and my mom was swearing Mainly on the road though like she would get pissed off at drivers and so we put in place to stop swearing a swear jar and whoever swore the least that week would get all the money in the swear jar and so me and my brother were like, oh, fuck, this is going to be easy. And so we just stopped swearing completely. Because my mom was like, once you start swearing, you're not going to be able to stop. And she was trying to prove that point to us. And then we proved to her that, yeah, we could stop anytime we wanted. And we just stopped swearing. And then my mom swore so much that me and him were just kind of pocketing money for my mother. And it was great. It was awesome. It was great. Loved it. Why can I not? Why is my music not playing? Oh, it's muted. It was awesome. Swearing is natural. I love it. What's up, GG Soft? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Guys, guys, guys. Let me tell you the drama. There's drama, chat. There's fucking drama. There's drama today, chat. Oh, my God. I know. I know. I can't believe it. Me neither. He did nothing wrong. We'll see about that. We'll see about that, dude, man. At 15, my mom would not let me swear. At 15, my mom would let me swear. Guys, there's drama today. Let's talk about it, chat. Now, chat. Now, chat. I don't know what the fuck it is with YouTubers. I don't know. Or, uh, YouTubers, TikTokers, content creators, whatever. I don't know what is with them. But they always, for some reason, you know, YouTube, YouTube, YouTuber is such a great job. You know what I mean? You get to just make videos and make money off of that. You literally, you know... You don't have to work a fucking slave to society, working class job, working at fucking Walmart all day or Target all day. You get to make creative videos, and that's awesome. It's a great job, and you make decent money. But, but, for some reason, every fucking YouTuber, or at least, at least a bunch of YouTubers, decide, ah, wouldn't it be fun for a YouTube video to, uh, to just work working class jobs? Uh, as content, you know what I mean? Uh, 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 hold on. Let me, let me, let me, let me pull one up. Let me pull, let me pull one up. Uh, uh, first we got, we got fucking, we got, uh, you know, Nico, Nico, uh, Omolana. And you know what? I'll give him credit where credit is due. I don't think this was disrespectful. I think it's, I think it's cool that he opened a fake McDonald's and he gave out stuff for free. 
You know, he gave out free food. That's awesome. And then we go a step lower than that. You know, he's still doing the working class job for content or whatever. But then we go a step below that. You know, he had creativity. And we get the fucking Charlie D'Amelio. Who recently decided it would be funny if she just... If she just, you know, worked at a Walmart for a TikTok. Let's look at this. Let's fucking... Let's look at this shit. Ha <laughs> ha She's just working at Walmart for a TikTok. And she's glorifying the working class job. The working class job has been glorified by TikTok star. The fucking second most followed person on TikTok, Charlie D'Amelio. I hate Charlie, you say. Wow, Charlie, such a terrible person, you say. Mocking the working class job when you make millions and millions of dollars off of making fucking YouTube uh, TikTok videos. And then today, chat, we come to today. A video has come out, and I need to document it. A video that I never could have anticipated, chat. I always mock Mr. Beast. I say he's a psychopath. I say he's crazy. I say... I say, Mr. Beast, you know, one day he's gonna kill someone for, he, you know, he, he traps people in the world's deadliest laser maze. He traps people in the world's deadliest trap. He, he buries himself alive and then he, he fucking makes every country on earth fight. He does a bunch of crazy shit to people that makes you think he must be a psychopath. He traps people in a circle for a hundred days. But today, I never could have expected this. Mr. Beast stooped so low. As to pull a Charlie D'Amelio, as we're going to call it today. <sighs> and Mr. Beast posted this today. One dollar versus ten million dollar job. First of all, what the fuck is a ten million dollar job? I'm clearly a football player. But you see here, even worse, even worse than Walmart. He's fucking mocking people who have to work it. At, at, at fucking McDonald's day to day to make enough money for their family <sighs> To make enough money to, for their family to survive and he's mocking it as a goddamn youtuber with, with 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 one of the most paid Fucking jobs ever making YouTube videos What's up beanie bugs? Welcome. How you doing? You look like the emo kid from Horton. Here's a who today It fucking I've heard a, a million people have told me that. Thank you so much beanie. Also. Hi beanie. What's up Nat? Ash Did you see the edit point made? I did see it. It was cool. Um, What's up, Zach the Funky Monkey? Guys, Mr. Beast today pulled a Charlie D'Amelio <laughs> and is mocking the working class. Also, I want to go back to that Horton Hears a Who thing. I actually uh, work uh, at, at my job. Um, I saw somebody who I hadn't seen since, like, fucking, like, third grade, uh, and I realized they were going to be my coworker when I first started working there. Uh, and they came up to me, and instead of saying, hi, haven't seen you in a long time, oh my god, how have you been? The first thing they said when they walked up to me was they pulled out their phone, they turned it around, and they went, you look like the guy from Horton Hears a Who. And they just fucking stared at me. And I was like, right, cool, it's good to see you. Anyways, and I walked away. That was uh, that was fun. So guys, Mr. Beast is mocking the working class's job. And guys, today we are t here to determine if he is cancelled or not. Guys, I, you can be the ju you can be the jury. I will be the judge to determine Mr. Beast's sentence to YouTube. Is he cancelled? Does he have to make an apology video? Does he have to make an apology tweet? Or is he let off scot free? Today we will decide that. Is he mocking the working class? Is he classist? Is Mr. Beast truly a terrible man? We'll see today. Thank you so- <laughs> this stream for you to raid on. Hello, Ali. Thank you so much for the raid. Uh, how was your stream? What did you do? What did you do? Guys, to catch you up to speed, to catch you up to speed, Mr. Beast is confirmed today as a classist YouTuber. He is mocking the working class like Charlie D'Amelio who made a video in Walmart glorifying. And so today we're watching the new Mr. Beast video and, and determining his sentence. You guys are the jury. I'm the judge. Is he cancelled? Does he have to make a YouTube apology? Does he have to make a Twitter apology? Or is he let off scot-free? This is what we're going to determine today. Is Mr. Beast classes? Thank you so much for the raid, by the way. How was your stream? What did you do? I. <laughs> this is a regular thing around here. We love to mock Mr. Beast.
Just look at the first job. He fucking put McDonald's in the goddamn thumbnail. To the gulag, I say. And guys, you know how he does every one of these fucking videos? Is he he goes from he does the one dollar job and then he instantly fucking skips to the a hundred thousand dollar one. He does not give a shit about the middle class. He does this with every one dollar versus fucking ten million dollar thing. Watch, he's gonna do it again. He's gonna do the first job, the one dollar one, and then he's gonna skip to fucking a hundred thousand or ten thousand. To work this $10 million dollar job. You already work a fucking $10 million dollar job, asshole. Okay. I don't give a sh- Okay, wait, this is kind of quiet, I think. Is it quiet, chat? I think it's quiet. A hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, and then it's gonna be one dollar. And so many other jobs. And so many other- Okay. paying job I could find, gold panning. That can make as little as one dollar a year. But we're gonna make- A year?! Statistics. Oof. That was rough, Mr. Beast. Basically not. Basically, gold panners put dirt in this mechanism. Oh, they put dirt in and I really j- the gold is filtered out to the bottom. <laughs> but it's not they just pray there's gonna be gold at the bottom. They just grab a bit of dirt and they're like, Hallelujah, pray, please. God almighty, there'll be gold in the bottom. You might as well fucking buy a lottery ticket at that point. I feel like you're After wasting less time. Hours of searching, I was definitely not rich. You might as well buy a lottery ticket. Or go gambling in Vegas. That is Wait, he actually found gold? Exactly my point. You could do this cent. for a whole year and only make That's a dollar. Pathetic. But luckily for us, we're I don't know why anyone would do that job. Ten million dollars per year. But first, let's see what a hundred thousand. That pays a hundred. I fucking knew it. Every fucking time. He goes straight to 100,000. Guys, we cancel Mr. Beast because he hates the middle class and he doesn't even want to... It's not even been a fucking minute and he's at 100,000. This is bullshit. This is fucking scammer. $1,000 fucking... per year. Digging up dinosaur bones for a museum. No! Oh my god! Guys! Okay, okay, okay. Another thing Mr. Beast does in every video recently is he's been blowing up fucking Earth. I predict he's gonna blow up the dinosaurs. Mr. Beast caused the fucking dinosaur. Oh no, he caused their extinction. In every video, he's just been blowing up the Earth. No, he's gonna do it again to the dinosaurs. Fuck you, Mr. Beast. Yes, these are fake because no. dead. So this is just one of our oh, pits. Never mind. Are these actually dinosaur bones? They are. So I've been here seven Mr. Beast killed years. the dinosaurs. Guys, it's confirmed in all the other videos where there were explosions. Mr. Beast killed the dinosaurs. The pits. Are these actually dinosaur bones? They That's are. pretty cool. That's pretty awesome, years. I won't lie. I'd love to see real dinosaur bones. In my this is your thigh bone. I can think of a larger bone. Right here, and it's over four feet tall. For comparison, here's that dinosaur next to six corals stacked on top of each other. Keep in mind, I'm six five. These are mini. Okay, I don't think Carl's three foot nine, uh, editor. I think you're a uh, dirty little liar and a whore and a <laughs> jackhammers essentially. How hey, you doing it? He has no idea what he's doing. He no what if Mr. What if Mr. Beast right now? He's like fucking doing these. He just destroys it and he destroys history forever. Now, this may come Piece as a of surprise, shit, Mr. Beast. God awful at this. Yeah, so Oops. don't do it. You're gonna destroy the bone for good. Hours to make any progress whatsoever. But even with us holding him back, with the help of the experts, we were getting. Mr. Beast, your time is, is worth so much more than that I've ever worked on in my hours. career. And you let me and Carl touch that? Absolutely. What if we messed it up? Poor Carl does not deserve to be associated with Mr. Beast. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> Josh, how much is this way? Probably gonna be yeah, I mean, sitting down. How tall is he? Nope. Oh, this is maybe. One yeah. tenth the weight of Nolan's sitting mom. Down. Oh. Nolan mom joke. Fucking every goddamn. Why is laser beam here? Oh, it's probably Australia. They they got dinosaurs there, right? They got the weirdest shit in Australia. That's why. Now, because this bone is so ancient, we have to cover <laughs> it in a cast before we pick it up, or else it could literally break in half. Let's hope it doesn't fall apart. <laughs> They're fucking. <laughs> Isn't uh, don't you put a cast on a bone that's already broken? That's crazy they're doing that. We lived it. One, two. That's like that's like you doing too much, man. That's some br yo. I, I'm surprised the dinosaurs. It took a meteor for them to get fucking extinct. You're telling me picking up a, the bone can make it break? It, it's like that fucking brittle. Dinosaurs are that weak. I could I could suplex a fucking dinosaur, man. Good job. This is the first time any I'm not impressed. Ever this bone. Just a YouTuber carrying a dinosaur bone. That's kind of hype. Not gonna lie. Because it's old. Believe it or not, this dinosaur bone did find its way into a museum. 
But because museums are boring, let's head over. No, to he did it. He's blowing up the fucking dinosaurs. No, I told you. And my first mission: learn to drive the official lunar rover. That's this pretty cool. Beyond the moon. Yeah, this is how we're gonna. Isn't get isn't the whole point of the rover? No. On the surface of the I moon. don't. They put rovers that are like robot fucking train that they don't. So people don't even have to go up there. Or am I crazy? Or am I insane? Why are they letting me drive this? Open the I don't know. Because you're Mr. Brett. How do I work this thing? Push forward on the What's up, right Fox now? Love? Yeah, go for it. Push forward. And Nemo, what's up? Don't kill us. I'm scared. You good? Oh, this is amazing. Go ahead and twist to the right. To the right. Mr. Reese playing a goddamn oh, video game right cars. now. Is this street legal? <laughs> this, guy, this guy's driving on a street and he's like, ah, oh, cars. Ah. Oh. You're the fucking weird one. You think the cars are the cars are sitting there going, ah, oh, fucking space rover? Uh, street illegal around here. Oh, this is. <laughs> Why are we driving sideways? I haven't figured out how to straight it yet. And even though I'm driving like I'm actually drunk, I still managed to get us to NASA's. And even though I'm driving like I'm actually drunk, I am drunk. Lunar training yard, where the real test is gonna be. Oh, we're off roading. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh, this is getting bumpy. You're gonna let me drive. Why is laser in here? Is there seat belts in this thing? There's a seat belt we don't use right there. Though. Yeah, <laughs> there's, there's a seat belts they don't use. That's, ah, I need a seat belt. I need a seat belt. Brother, you are in a really NASA fucking that ship. That's what you're concerned oh about? Wait, we're going down the hill That's kind of cool, though, the rover, how it like can go on every terrain. It's kind of sick. Would you guys still think I was cool if I was Mr. Beast? Yeah. Oh, no, no. Give me money. Lift your hand so they can see I'm driving. I, he's actually like. Oh, I'll get up and let Nick. No, 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 sit there. No. Go sideways in the crater. Sure. Hold me. Don't speak too soon, Mr. Beast. Hold me. Landon, I'm just gonna say wow. you wouldn't survive on the moon. Uh, I reckon I could do it. <laughs> Bro's asking for a seat belt. I reckon he could do it. Bro is. Bro is asking Carl for. He's like, hold me, Carl. Ooh. Don't want to know what happens when Carl holds laser beam. It's gonna make a explosive reaction. A laser reaction. Next I'm, in training, NASA I don't even know what that means. Their enormous space facility. Oh, these are so cool! I love the underwater fucking NASA shit. That shit's so cool. Especially when they I would want to become an astronaut just so I can do the underwater training. Just for that. There was a catch. When you go on a spacewalk, you have to wear a diaper. You're in the suit. Also to see the Earth from. Wow. I'd be. There's a lot of reason I'd become an astronaut. Okay. So be careful. This is a space. I really hope Mr. Beast poo poo his pants. Several times. He had diaper. I really hope he poo poo his pants. Have you peed in this suit? I not in this suit. No. Okay. He's like, oh, it's fine. Just because specifically you didn't pee in it, but someone else did. When's the next mission? What are you doing a, a year from now? I can make time. Okay. Okay. And the final step of my training was the dude. If Mr. Beast goes to space for a YouTube video, that would be wild. That would be awesome, though. First YouTuber to go to space. That'd be pretty fucking cool. Oh my god, and then he actually blows up the earth. Like he does in every video. Guys, it's the plan. It's the plan. Guys, this is part of his elaborate plan. He's getting he's getting in good with NASA now so that he can actually blow up the earth later. And like those videos where he blows up the earth in the video are foreshadowing it. Ah, Mr. Beast! Craziest thing I've ever done. They were gonna let me touch the moon. No, no, lean back into it because it weighs 9,000 pounds. Touch the moon? This weighs 9,000 pounds? This is Yo, the Mr. Beast is gonna have chronic back damage. The I can't believe they're letting us do this. Yo, Realize they actually- I forgot control. they, like, just have moon rocks. <laughs> oh my god. This Ash is just just figured it out. Dude, moon. I figured out his ploy. Let me touch the Genesis rock. Zero. <laughs> Yesterday, we dug up a dinosaur fossil. So I'm an expert in this kind of stuff. Can I touch it? No. I tried. This I downloaded Discord? Hell yeah, join my Discord. Join my Discord! Switcher Exclamation here. point Discord yeah. in the chat. Soil. Bro's, touching the moon bro's just touching oh, the moon. That's actually that fucking crazy. I would love to touch the moon. I like. I would love to go to the moon. If I had the opportunity to go to the moon, I would do it in a heartbeat. Tube heartbeat. Has dirt from the moon. It has not been open since it came back. And since you haven't checked in theory, there could be an alien. Yes. Well, it would be the first from the moon. Wait. From the moon. <laughs> you guys heard that? And after we found out aliens were totally uh -oh. real, we headed to the stratosphere. Mr. Beast, you're gonna die now. Carl you're gonna fucking die now that you revealed that the aliens are real. Nolan are gonna you're gonna get fucking killed I've by the CIA. Before. We have no idea what we're doing. Welcome to the first day of flight training. 
I'm not joking. For the boys to somehow fly a real plane, I can't all believe they have Nolan. They're letting Nolan of anyone. All right, here we have oh, it's a flight simulator. Back, Mexico, slower. Oh, they just. Oh, oh wait, they're actually gonna fly a plane though. Oh my god! And after Nolan, this crashed. is just a training one. Oh god! And crash. Oh and crash. You Austin show wouldn't. Austin show wouldn't crash. Guys, have you seen Austin show fly a plane? That shit's impressive. <laughs> That shit is awesome. He and eventually impressive. did land successfully, which for whatever reason gave him the keys to fly this real plane. There's no yeah, way. Hey, if you can't do this, Nolan, please, for love of God, let them know now. Oh, oh my God, I'm gonna fly a plane. Oh my God. Right, here we go. You ready to go? Ready I want to make a feet. joke about oh, Nolan's mom oh, with the plane. Wobbly, I don't know what it is though. Uh, it's somewhere. It's oh, in my God. head. Plane wouldn't be able to fly with Nolan's mom. There you go. Yes, he is, all by himself. I don't know. Hey, Not a very good one. It'd be so funny if Nolan crashed no. and just died. Oh, Wait, why is it? I can't believe that I'm controlling this thing. Am I still live? I am live. Okay. I For some reason, it started... Rec I pressed space bar and I started recording. So I was worried that I accidentally stopped streaming at some point when I pressed space bar. Look, no hands! Stop! Oh, oh sweet Jesus! You Holy shit! I would go no I would go no hands in a plane. Oh my god, I forgot. That's the one thing it's always a challenge for people. Alright, I'm descending. My mental health is descending also. This is the part I crashed in every time oh. in a simulator. Oh god. Ah! We're gonna land right there on top of that. Oh I'm so scared. Oh I'm actually terrible. Well, actually close. Do you think if Nolan actually died here he'd leave it in the video? He totally would, right? I feel like in all their wills, it's like they have written if I die in the video, leave it in. Right? Keep it pointed right down the middle. Oh my god. I feel like that's in the contract. That if one of the main Mr. Beast members die, they have to leave it in the video. And then it cancelled like Logan Paul. I'm good. I'm very tired, but I don't need sleep. Also have school tomorrow. Yay! That's actually kinda hype. He said I couldn't do it. That's impressive. Also, Mr. Genius. Mr. Beast didn't do the 300,000 job. He said he would do all the jobs, and he didn't. I'm surprised that the job that pays $1 million a year is hand modeling. But only if you're one of the highest paid hand models. My the hands could... Chad, do you think my hands would work? Do you think my hands would work? Do you think I could... Her I could... And her resume is stacked. I could get... She's hand modeled for almost know. any brand you've ever heard of. Her hands are even insured for $1 million per hand. I can't wait to see this in action. So to start us off, she examined our hands. I didn't know that today was going to be the day that I not yay insecurities okay Whoa. so immediately I can see the nails need work of course agreed these hands suck hey I hey how much hair is here compared to Carl can I get paid more for that the skin texture might be better here with these two can you what about my hands I can, work miracles. can I ask her <laughs> I haven't seen your do you think I could be a hand model chat I could totally be a corpse husband should be a hands model Great hands. Are your hands so glossy? <laughs> I don't know. Are my finger structures good? Uh, yeah. No, they're very good actually. But again, we've got cute. I actually have weird fucking hands, chat. Look how big my knuckles are. Look how fucking huge my knuckles are. It's so hard to put on rings because I have a fucking massive knuckle. Like I can't take this ring off. Like I have a big fucking knuckle. I have big ass knuckles. Look at them. Holy shit. And I have like I have like long. I have like skeleton hands. It's weird. Issues, skin issues here, you can't. Can fixed. Our hands clearly needed work, so we had to prepare them to shoot. Which was oh my god, oh, Mr. Oh, Beast oh, is oh, getting oh, a mani oh, pedi. Oh, god. Bro, you can make a rug out of all that hair. <laughs> this hair's been with me my whole life, but you gotta do what you gotta do if you wanna make a million dollars. And now that my hands are no longer disgusting, we're gonna model for an actual magazine. And these photos are literally gonna be shown on billboards all across America. Wait, that's kind of sick. Watches. That's petrifying. Yeah, no, no pressure. Okay. I mean, the watch that actually the watch. is not bad. That's actually not terrible. Like, I, that's actually good. Like, I'd see that and I'd be like, nice hand. That's actually not bad. Hello, yo, what's up, Spooky? How you doing? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. I honestly thought this was going to be easy, but we were actually horrible at this. It looks like the watch is on a snake. <laughs> Bro, this is so hard. Can I see the difference with you doing it? Oh, what? Unreal. The product looks better because her hand doesn't shake as much. But being a hand model isn't all Bro, about that shit wearing nice the same. watches. Sometimes you have to model weird things. Why are you squirming? Oh I my god, it keeps accidentally <laughs> starting to record, dude. 
Breathe, Carl, breathe. Put your other hand out here and kind of support his head. Yeah, of course. Ah, it's a snake! I don't like those. I don't like snakes. Just hold that right there. Okay, perfect. Now he's I don't like snakes. A snake in this game. I'm like Indiana Jones. Immortals of Avium is a first like Indiana Jones. Oh, shut the Jack fuck up, pussy. With the scorpion. No way. Shut up, I don't need your damn sponsor. You, you already got a million dollars from the. Is this actually safe for the animal? Yes. Perfect, perfect. Get it, get it, go. Oh my. Talk and go, and talk about the. Game. You can sling 25 different types. Oh my god, that is a deadly fucking. That is a poisonous fucking. Carl, you think Immortals of Avium are gonna love that photo? Immortals of Avium, I hope you love No, nah, I would fucking never. Never, d no, uh, pussy snakes are awesome. No, they're so slimy and gross. The, NFL for a final job. the people who created Immortals of Avium also helped make the award-winning campaigns of Halo, Call of Duty. Ash, I gotta go to sleep. No, you don't. That's some pussy shit. <laughs> oh, it's moving. And the coolest thing is, they put me in the That's game. That's terrible. Nah. If you kill me in the game, you okay, get shut more. the fuck up, Jimmy. <laughs> Ah, tarantula! I'm gonna shut the fuck. I, like I'm not playing this game. I don't play games like that. We were doing such a bad job that we had the hand. They aren't slimy at all. Yes, they are. Yes, they fucking are. I have felt snakes before and I hate it. Feel I've felt snakes. It's the worst. Like not even out of fear. It's the worst fucking feeling ever. I hate feeling snakes. It's terrible. I hate it. I remember in school, they would like, they, they'd like, oh, fun snake day, and they'd bring in snakes, and then they'd make us touch them, and they fucking, I hated it. I hate them. I hate them. Click the link in the description if you want to play Immortals of Okay, Avium fine, right Mr. Beast. I won't I'm do it. I'm retiring as a hand model. And even though our photos weren't great, we still got them on billboards all across the country. And now, it's finally time for the job that pays 10... It's Mr. Beast 10, though. So, like, people are like, oh my god, Mr. Beast 10. I know that guy. Let me buy the watch. Million Instead of random lady hand. Year. That's right. I'm about to literally join the NFL. No, not literally. Not, I, I don't think you know the definition of lit literally. You're not literally joining the NFL. You're you're doing a a a a, a publicity stunt uh, on the NFL. And if you think this is all fake, he did here actually I am do it. Signing a real contract to become oh. a literal player for the Buccaneers worth. Never mind. Ten million dollars. It might say we're not going to pay it, but it at least says that dollar amount. No, no, focus on the dollar amount. And now it's official. Congratulations. So for the next forty-eight hours, I'm officially a player. Forty. Okay. A player. You, I you know what? Won't let you down. I promise he will let you down. <laughs> By the end of my contract, I'm gonna be running out with the team on the field in front of 60. Oh, they're gonna bench his ass. They're gonna bench his motherfucking ass, dude. Fans. The first step is. That's so training. funny. It might be too late. Let's go up. Let's yeah, go up. Easy, I don't actually easy, think they're guy. paying me the 10 minutes. Hasn't Mr. Beast been like working out? Or are you a Falcon? Easy. Yeah. I'm Carl, the, uh, those shorts are not doing you good. I'm not gonna. The big, like that shirt's way too big. With these short, with these mini ass shorts, it's not working, man. <laughs> I'm just saying. They yell a lot when you're an NFL player. Can you set it to whatever the strongest player in your team does? I'm gonna see if I can do what. He cannot play. He can do 12 of these. Holy crap! He's not a normal human. Uh, I would hate to be hit by him. <laughs> Mr. Beast is kind of strong. Wait. Yeah. He did the he did the one that the strongest person on the team can do. That's pretty good. I've talked with, does anyone know what in chat what a Therian is? So no clue. Ugh. How does this compare to their typical workouts? Pretty pathetic. Hopefully Zero clue what a Therian is. You get used to it. <laughs> okay. Up next was they didn't put him in. They're totally going to bench him. They're totally going to, they're going to, they're going to start the game. They're going to start the game. This motherfucker is going to sit down on the bench and he is going to watch that entire game and do jack shit. Fuck all. Stop clicking fucking record. Oh my god, I have like, Buccaneers. sorry, I have like seven fucking recordings I've just done. I'm deleting these right fucking now. Stop recording. Oh my, I've, I've, I've stop. Where are they? Where the fuck are they? Dude, go away, you fucking piece of shit. Stop. Del can I fucking delete these shit? Yeah, there you go. Delete. Thank you. Training facility. So naturally, I met my coach. Oh, How's it going? Cold. How you doing? Cold. Good. And my new teammates. Good to meet you, man. My name is Shaq. I wonder if he's like a fan of the Buccaneers, and he's like, and he's like fanboying out right now, and he's like losing his shit. 
I really hope he is. Bye, Ashy. I'm going to leave. I don't watch Mr. Beast anymore. You are right now. That's rough. Why did he pick that team? I don't know. Aren't they like well, ass? Teammates couldn't believe I don't know, guys. I don't know anything team. about so I showed them my contract football. This is the same one you guys signed? I think you got more money than me, though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But if you read, it says, unless it's canceled in 48 hours, we're still going to cancel. Uh, yeah, yeah, look at that. Enjoy head turning offers during my Nope, I'll be leaving. Bye. Womp, womp. Womp, oh, freaking sure. womp. Hey, you're official. Welcome to I know. Uh, thank you. Hey, my hey, new teammates over here. Bro, all these guys that spent like, like years, fucking years training to be a football player, going through, you know, high school, college, uh, going through tryouts, going through tr the, the worst trial and error in their fucking life. Just trying to get on the team and finally making a spot on the team. And Mr. Beast is like, I'm making $10 million and you are, motherfucker. And I, I, I'm i just a YouTuber. I make goddamn videos. And then Carl's just here, chilling. That's rough. Oh, these guys make us look like children. They're so they didn't big. let him play. My dad said comparison. they didn't, so. <laughs> I don't I'll know. be honest, I've never played football before. So they threw me on as kicker, which. Oh. I was terrible at. Mr. Beast, we need you out. We gotta get ready for tomorrow. You're nah, right. he can't be the kicker. Make him the guy that holds the ball. <laughs> you're right, you're right. I'll keep it. And since I've never played quarterback before either, uh, hi. I just threw one up as far as Make I him could. the guy that holds the ball. <laughs> That's touchdown. In case you didn't know, the team I just joined is the same team Tom Brady won the Super Bowl with. So I thought it'd be funny to surprise him. Zam. Oh, we got him. Tom. Oh, I Bro just knows Tom Brady. That's so weird. Got hit. TB, what's up, baby? What's up, TB? What's up, bro? Yo. I have a friend here who might literally die of hack. Did Tom Brady fucking retire? Is he still doing football? I don't know. Penis, if you no, say you, I do. You, you can't do this to me. You yes, can't do this to me. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. After that, our practice. He knows his name. To shenanigans. I, ah! Why does Tom? Why does famous footballer Tom Brady know Lennon Laserbeam? Is he a big fan? He loves his uh he loves his Fortnite but I don't move video. He loved his Fortnite but I didn't even move but I but I I didn't move video. Oh, big fan. Oh, Too small. Yeah. You could go back to film. Nah, right, Tom Brady that. watches Some Fortnite content on the on the about my two day contract. on the side, Outdoors, you know. The Bucks set up a press conference for me. We obviously have a big game. I'm expecting very serious questions on. Is this just a publicity stunt? Why are you really here? To make the best video possible? Yes, it's a publicity stunt. I clearly am not an NFL player. Jimmy, how does it feel being You actually are. You signed a contract to say you actually are clearly one. Wasn't Tom Brady in the yacht video? Yeah, he was. It feels he great. In the yacht to be video. honest, they accepted me way more than I thought. <laughs> How much playing time are you expecting? Uh, none. It'd be so funny if everyone was just fucking assholes to him. And like, he got into like the training area and they're like, fuck you doing here, man. Fuck you. We work years for this and you're goddamn just coming in, coming here, stopping out of territory. And they're all just fucking dickheads. That'd be so funny. And they, they beat the shit out of Mr. Beast. And he's like, oh, I'm sorry for making fun of the working class. And after explaining over and over again that it's just a stunt, I went to go get measured. Six plus four, four and a half. It'd be so funny if, like, one of the jobs Mr. Beast did for this. Because he did, like, jobs at different levels. And, uh, you know, they de the job I'm about to mention definitely makes over $100,000 a year. What if he fucking did a doctor and he just went to a hospital and he just fucked up surgery on someone? Sorry, I just, I thought I'd mention this. And he just fully started playing, like, the Surgeon Simulator video game, but on a real-life human, and he caused irreparable damage. Anyways, just a thought. Hydrate- Fuck! I- ugh, I don't have any water. Okay, just give me a second. I'll be back in, like, I'll be back in, like, le in, in tw 26 seconds, okay? Three, two, one, go. I decided to take my sweet fucking time. It's been 26 seconds. Yeah, I walked. I, uh... 
I, I walked like a shithead. Six four and a half. Carl, you're six five. I'm six five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. These measurements are key, so that my Why are they dogging on Carl this video? They're like bros four two. Why are they dogging on Carl? Are all custom fitted. <laughs> this actually looks so good. There we go. Bro, and look. Now that I'm suited shut the fuck up, laser babe. It does not look good. Bro looks goofy as shit. He got the shoulder pads like he's a fucking, <laughs> like he's in fucking court in the eighties or whatever. You know what I'm talking about. You get what I'm referencing. It up. It's time for the official game day. I still don't know why they're letting me do this, but hey, thanks, Bucks. Are you surprised they let me join the team? Yeah. That's my first. Mr. Beast. Football I've ever signed. Oh, Jimmy's about to come out any second now. They say if you get up by 100, I can play a play. That's so funny. They don't even put like Donaldson on his back, like Jimmy Donaldson. They just put Mr. Beast. Not even Beast. Shouldn't it just be Beast, guys? Because it's just a last name on the back, right? It should just be Beast, not Mr. Beast. Guys, it doesn't make sense. Let's be Do real. me a favor and get up super high. Bro. Let's be real. It's his first game and probably his last. Yes. Definitely his last. How is this happening? Are those real fucking cannons? Why do they have cannons? Imagine that's your first game and Mr. Bruce. <laughs> I'm just thinking of the possibilities of all these players and what they're thinking. Sidemen charity match? No, no, no. Fucking NFL on the Buccaneers. I really hope the Bucks lost that day. I think it'd be really funny if, the, if Mr. Beast had like a 100% fucking lose rate. Either way, he has a 100% lose rate or 100% win rate in NFL football as a player. I probably won't get played, Doug. It'd be so funny if they put him on the field. Let's be honest. They're going to bench him, but... Huge shout out to the Buccaneers for making me an official NFL player. It's honestly a good thing I didn't play because if they hit me, I probably would have died. And I thought it was all over there until the Falcons made fun of me on Twitter. So in retaliation, I'm going to nuke their stadium. No! Stop it! You can't keep doing this, Mr. B you can't keep nuking people. Okay, guys. Is Mr. Beast canceled? Let's think about this, right? He did not he did not mock working class jobs. He didn't like do a Charlie Domenio. Thank God. Thank God. But he did intentionally leave out the middle class again. Yet again, he left out the middle class. I don't know if it's because he didn't want to mock them, or if it was because, you know, he doesn't care for the jobs, and he doesn't want to, you know, spread awareness to people that are living in such terrible conditions. And, and so I must, I must ask this. I must ask this question. Um... I'm disappointed. Is he can't? I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm disappointed. I, I was really hoping for some Mr. Beast, uh, you know, cancellation to happen uh, fairly soon, but it didn't. Uh, it didn't happen. He's medium canceled. Why? Why? Like he didn't. He didn't do shit. I don't know, guys. I'm a little. I'm a little depressed. I'm not gonna lie. I thought. I thought it was gonna be worse than that. I thought he was gonna like be a terrible person. And he was gonna, he was gonna ruin people's lives. Here's the thing: at the end of the day, he's still a content creator. It would be terrible, difficult to make actual content out of the middle class. Yes, it would be terrible of him. I think, I think, good of him for not doing that. I think all of the other videos up to this point, because every time he skips the middle class, and I don't know if to see that as an insult or, 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 or as a good thing, because he's like not trying to mock them. You know what I mean? Either way, I think he's fucked. Either way, I think he's fucked. I think Mr. Beast is a heartless human being. Um, and I'm joking. Uh, I think he's actually a really great YouTuber. <laughs> uh, frankly, I'm a little disappointed. I'm not gonna lie. I'm so, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that I... I made you go through that, frankly. Um, because, I mean, it wasn't, it wasn't what I expected it to be. My man is fine. He is innocent. Fine. You know what? I deem, I deem Mr. Beast innocent. There you go. There you go. Big claps for Mr. Beast. He, 
big big claps. Mr. Beast, he did the right thing. Good job, Mr. Beast. You didn't you didn't make fun of working class. Instead of doing McDonald's like you did in the and you know what? It's kind of fucked up. He did it in the trailer, McDonald's, but instead of doing McDonald's, he did fucking gold sifting. Which honestly, I feel like anybody who works in gold sifting deserves to get made fun of. So, uh, so I mean, good on him, man. Get up and stretch. Fine. Like, good on you. Know what I mean? Like, like, like if you're really gonna waste your time sifting for fucking gold, making two cents a day, like I don't know, man. I, I just I feel like I feel like you deserve to get made fun of a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Two cents a day. God damn it, go mining. Gold mining. So it's, it's there for a reason. The, the the underground mines are there for a reason. You gotta fucking sift through dirt. This ain't no goddamn fucking uh what's it called? This ain't no sky factory, my guy. This ain't no Minecraft Sky Factory. What are you doing? Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. Ugh. 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 But why am I playing this song again? Shut the fuck up, pussy. Guys. I didn't have anything else planned today. Uh, I actually almost didn't stream today. Uh, because, uh, reasons. But I did anyways. Uh, let's play FNAF now. I almost didn't stream today. Uh, so I think I am gonna go, but I saw me I saw the video of Mr. Beast and I was like I have to stream I was like I have to stream this I was like I need to I need to so I think I'm gonna end stream I'm sorry. Thank you so much for coming to the stream. Also Morg has not been live after me in a while guys uh, I'll be live for longer next time. Sorry that I took uh, that I didn't stream as long today But I'll be live for longer next time everybody join the raid Get free channel points. I know this is like the shortest stream I've done in fucking ages. Uh, but you guys also did keep me up last night, uh, which was fucked up. Uh, because I, I was I was 15 minutes late to work today. So fuck you. It's your fault for keeping me up and making me do night six last night. So I'm giving you a short stream today. 40 fucking six minutes. That is the shortest stream I've done in ages. Uh, thank you for coming. Uh, and yeah, right Ash Raid in more Extreme. I also haven't raided Morg in a bit because I haven't been live in a bit. Um, so yeah, it was your choice. Nah, nah. Uh, thank you for coming and, uh, everybody have a good night. Bye. I'll see you next stream. Bye.